What's going on guys? Welcome to this video. So tonight, Timothy and I are actually doing our develop and hang session on our Patreon. And I just finished a roll of T-Max in my Leica M4. So I kind of wanted to just bring you along for the ride for this. Uh, this will be the second time we've done it. So I'm pretty excited. There's gonna be a few people in the Zoom call with us. Um, so we're gonna develop, we're gonna hang out, and then I'm gonna scan everything with my negative supply tools, my negative supply um, basic kit. So I'm excited to show you guys that as well. Um, so let's get to it. So I'm just getting everything put into the dark bag right now. I also have to rewind my film first in my Leica. So I'm gonna do that. Pressing rewind, rewinding, rewinding, rewinding. These develop and hang nights, we're trying to make this a uh, monthly thing. Because number one, they're super fun. Number two, it makes me at least shoot more black and white. And number three, we just want to be more active on our Patreon. Okay. There she is. Ooh, T Max. Okay, put this back and put her away. Show everybody. That's so funny to me because you're like, I have about 40 rolls and I'm like, I finished one black and white. So just finished up the Analog Talk Patreon develop and hang night. Wanted to show you, we have negatives. We have images. So pretty exciting. And now I'm gonna show you guys how I scan. Just basically scan for you guys. So. This is my negative supply basic scanning kit, ready to go right there. So this by no means, by the way, is a negative supply, like um, full review or anything. I just wanted to check out the images. So this is their Mark One, Film Carrier Mark One for 35 millimeter scanning. So. This is not my camera either, by the way. I haven't gotten a macro lens for my Canon uh, EOS R, so I'm borrowing this from the office. It is an EOS M50 and a macro lens right here. So, we're gonna get the negatives. I'll show you that. So this is with a, the negative supply full, full border guides. So you can see in there, you can see the, the borders on that, which I don't typically like. I'll probably crop them off, crop them out maybe, depending on how they look, but it's a pretty cool feature. Guys, so I wanted to give you a little bit better view here of this. So everything's set up, ready to go. Um, what I'm gonna do is use live view on Capture One to make sure that my image is in focus so I can actually zoom in and check. And then I could use the manual focus on the camera to make sure it's nice and sharp, which it looks like it is. 
use my handy dandy dust removal brush and then I'm going to hit the space bar to capture the image. So once I've done that, I can move on to the next one. Turning, line it up, dust removal brush, and then check focus. Looks good. Capture the scan. And then move on to the next image and capture the scan. All right, so next I'm gonna show you how to convert the scans. All right guys, so this is a program called Film Lab. And what I'm doing here is convert, taking the negative and converting it into a positive essentially. So what I did is select the black and white uh, option and it, you can really go into this program and kind of um, really adjust your fi final image, the look of it. You can adjust the exposure time, the contrast, the brightness, and you can really play along, play around with those dials to get the look that you are going for. And this, let's see, a little bit more contrast here. Give it more exposure time, some more brightness. And I think that looks pretty good. Yeah. I'm do another image here. So this again, grab your negative from your captures. Let's see, let's find a good one for you. I did go around and, and convert some of these already, so I just wanted to kind of give you an idea of the of my process, I guess. Here's a good one. Oh, no, don't like that one. <laughs> Here we go. So now this one is super dark and you can really go in and bring back the highlights and bring back this image all together, which is pretty awesome. A little brighter, looks good. Add a little contrast. Looks good. And you can just save it. Already saved it there. But that'll save the image for you. And that's basically Film Lab. Right, guys that's basically it thank you so much for watching this video thank you again to everybody who came to our patreon develop and hang night um, i had a blast developing some film with you guys and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video like and subscribe and i'll see you next time good night